Is there some reason I should be talking to you? Am I selling? Yeah. Am I selling to you? No. Sorry to hurt your feelings, but you're small time. Move along. You might be onto something. I like to hang on to any weapons mods I run across. Take a look. Okay, everybody's lined up and ready to go. Any suggestions? You heard the man, people. Get focused. I've got the one at 11 o'clock. Raz, O'Hanrahan, take the two on the right. Poindexter, the center. Right. Exhale, squeeze. Focus on the shot. Thanks for the help. I think the whole unit's doing a lot better now. Yes, outsider? Really, outsider? I'm open to ideas. Wow, our stockpiles mostly include full metal jacket. I should start a reloading class for the children to learn how to make ammunition. Because that's the law of the land. You never know when someone's going to stab you in the back. And I like mine upright. Maybe one day, stranger, when you've seen all I've seen, done all I've done, you'll sooner trust a rad scorpion than a new face in the wasteland. You've got a sharp eye on you. I take it you like guns, huh? Question is, can you handle more than just a weapon? I mean, you've got to know yourself before you can truly know the gun. So let's see it, stranger. Do you know yourself? Keep your distance. Who are you and what do you want? Are they back? Ah! Well, you seem like you know how to handle yourself. Right. Once, I fired a lucky shot, hit a gas tank one was holding, blew his arm off at the shoulder, and he didn't get back up after that. So if you're that good, don't aim for the head, aim for their bombs. And if you can wait until his buddies are close by, even better. What's it sound like I'm saying? If I was saying what you said I was saying, then yeah, I said it. I was walking along, minding my own, and up pops one of them brotherhoods. He yells, hand over that laser rifle, asshole. So I hand it over, just to make him think I'm scared. But really, I'm not. I never am. Before he knows what hit him, I draw my 11 millimeter machine gun and bam, bam, right through the eye slit in his helmet. D.O.A. There so is. Or was a 9mm? Or a 10? I don't know. Don't care. Said I was good at killing shit up. Never said I was good with numbers. What did it say? Spit lead? What, like pencils? Oh, I think it wants a combustion pistol. A gun? Are you mad? We can't give it a gun. Guns kill. Leave big open holes in you that are like sores, but worse. Dr. Eight is correct. 
We already have given the teddy bear a lethal sonic death ray, filled with his sonic ejaculate and sterilized by my soft wing. Giving the teddy bear a gun would be the equivalent of following the glass of hemlock with an Abraxo chaser. Delicious and redundantly deadly. If you're going to bring the Socratic method into it, fine. Give the Lobato bear a combustion gun. Burroughs, don't you have something like that? Are you mad? We can't give it a gun. Guns? Wait, I said that already. Yes, I have the Cyberdog gun. With the little floppy metal ears and the curious nose sensor. Here. Fine. Done. That gun makes me uncomfortable anyway. Always worried it's going to hump my chassis. Anything else, Lobotomite? Fine. Moros, more ammo. The good stuff. Top shelf ammunition. Let's see. Hollow point? That's worthless, but tasty. Oh, and here's some JFP. As if bullets need jackets. The JFP might make it ill and poop a lot, but when you're hungry, you're hungry. Yes, very good. I should have Mentats ingest you instead of the other way around. Mmm, Mentats. In any event, you showed up at the think tank, and because you had suffered a cranial injury in just the right place, bullets in the head are usually much more fatal, and yours was a light case of bullet headitis. But it was enough for the autodoc in the sink to change its programming to fix the problem, and the brain extraction technology for once worked. That gave the think tank the knowledge its brains shouldn't, uh, couldn't, uh, couldn't possess. With that knowledge, the procedure can be reversed. If they obtain that procedural data, they can use it to mush and modify their cranial cells into hosts to slip past the radar fence. I'm sure of it. And once they're off the reservation, 